Hey guys, what's up? CT out in the garage. Today, we're going to attempt to repair this lower A post. This is the new piece. This is the old piece. Let's see what happens. Stay tuned. It's going to be exciting. All right, guys, before we get started, I just want to give you a quick summary of what's going on here. We're going to try to remove this old, worn out piece. This is actually all one piece originally, but they created this lower section, obviously, because this is probably the most common part that gets rusted out. Uh, the issue here is it's connected to a bunch of other pieces. It's connected to this piece on the back side. It's connected to this piece. It's all connected. And to do the job completely 100% right, you really have to replace all of these pieces, which we're not going to do right now. So this is an attempt to repair this lower section and keeping the rest of it as it is. So keeping that in mind, let's see what happens. Stay tuned. Okay. So what I'm thinking here, I've been out here analyzing this for a while and, um, I watched, uh, mix, bus being worked on and they do show this section in pretty good detail uh, the only difference is is his whole front nose has been completely removed so they have a lot better access and they're doing you know they're replacing all these panels so um, this is going to be a little different this is going to be more like a patch some patchwork here we're basically want to take this piece out and slide this piece in there maybe keep some of the original here that we can attach to so i think where we're going to start i think i'm going to cut it right here to start i'm going to cut it here we're going to peel this back kind of open this up so we can see how this is going to fit in there that's the plan check it out Pretty hot here today, guys. Very humid. I'm already sweating. I haven't even started doing anything, really. So be patient with me as uh, we dig into this. We'll see what happens. Got some new safety goggles. I got little readers at the bottom. I kind of wish the readers were bigger, like half and half. And let's see how they work. And I don't know. Do I need these? Maybe. All right, let's get started. All right, here we go. <laughs> Can't believe I'm doing this. Oh boy. Let's see what happens. Some of that rust inhibitor drip behind there.
Hey guys, how's it looking? So I'm just cutting it back slowly to figure out what we can leave so that we have something to attach to. I mean, that piece was pretty much shot. All those pieces are pretty much shot, so we're not going to be attaching to that. We could possibly attach a little bit right here. That's where the original one, there's a little groove there on that front, front piece, on the front nose. This whole front nose, this little groove goes over that groove. I'm just peeling it away to see what we can leave, what we can attach to here. See, I'm thinking about just leaving this and this backside and kind of nestle it up in there. We could probably get rid of this piece and attach it to this back piece here. Look at those it's just welds are just popping right off. That's how deteriorated it is. <laughs> those just came right off. So if we leave because this piece, this back piece here. This back piece here, see, we can just leave this and leave this and butt it up in there and then figure out how we can attach it here. We'd spot weld a couple spots in there. We're going to have to dig the rest of this out, it looks like. But this piece, see this notch right here? That's the notch there. So we got to get that. This has to go up to there. And then this piece here can attach here. So we've got some points to weld. We can weld here, 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 here. And then we got to figure out a point here that we can weld somehow. Maybe put a piece in here, weld it up from underneath, and it's got some, you know, we could slide it up in there. I don't know. We're going to have to work through it. Never done this before. I've never seen anybody do it this way. So we're going to have to think outside the box a little bit here, guys, because we want to keep the original lower nose. We're not doing that part yet. We're going to do that some other time stay tuned all right let's keep digging this out a little bit Let's see. All right, 
let's see where we're at here. There's actually the bottom of a bracket right here, pretty thick, um, that we can attach to. We might be able to uh, slide up underneath there and attach, weld on the back side here, looks like. Maybe, although we can't really get behind it. We'd have to notch this a little bit we might do that. Maybe we'll do that. We can get a nice good weld on this side anyway. And then uh, we may be able to weld here, weld to that piece there. We're getting there. Just slowly uh, chipping away at it to see what we can save and what we can weld to. I don't think that's going to cause us any issues as far as, you know, the extra thickness here. Because this, you know, we should be able to knock it back a little bit if we need to. So there is a, see the bottom of that bracket there? That's a pretty heavy uh, gauge. And that bracket is in there so that you can connect the uh, door hinge. So there's a really thick, heavy-duty door hinge bracket in there. So normally, you would go up around that, or that bracket goes inside this just a little bit. But we can't do that because we're not taking off all the other stuff. So... Uh, Cause we can't really, we can't really attach. We take this off. That's all deteriorated back here. So there's really not anything to attach to if we take off the back side of this. So that's why I want to leave that. That gives us some, some meat to attach to a little bit here. Well, right here, I'm thinking, we can weld to that, this piece to that piece, this piece to that piece. We just got to figure out how to get this up a little higher and maybe put in a piece here somehow that we can slide up into and then have a piece on the front here that, that we can attach to because there's, it's so, there's nothing here. This is all gone. So we need to figure out how we can get a piece in here that we can attach to. Um, that's the other reason for leaving that, that piece there. We can attach right here. So, but we need to get up. We need to get this up a little higher. All right, so we're gonna, we're gonna notch this right here and right here and we're just going to try to push this in a little bit see how that works we might have to notch it here too we might have to notch it here we might have to notch it here and here and just push it in a little bit and then notch it right here, push that in. That way we can fit it up inside. We can fit it up on the inside of those two, these here, because we can't get behind those. So we want to go on the inside here. So we're just going to notch them up in there. See how that works. All 
right, we got those notched. Let's uh, bend them back just a little bit. See if that fits in there. Getting there. I need to uh, what's holding us up here? I need to notch this out a little bit. Pretty close, just need to go up a little further over here. Not too bad, I'm gonna keep tweaking on it. See what it looks like from the front. Hey, it doesn't look too bad. Not too bad. Almost right there with the with that notch. We're hitting that piece there. And we're also going to hit there. Hmm. Where can we? I need to go up this notch over here. to be 
See, this piece comes out. The original piece came out here, out beyond, kind of like how this is here. There's just nothing to attach to it right here. Give me some advice, guys, on this piece right here. Can we put something inside there? Is there something we can attach somehow here? Just fold up a piece under here, weld it, boom, boom, boom. And maybe, you know what I'm talking about, like a little... Something like that. Tack it up underneath here. And uh, so bring it about the size of my finger. Tack it under here. Boom, boom. And then bring a piece out that we can uh, overlay here. Kind of bend it down over the top of this here. Because I don't think this went up much further. I think this is about the height of the patch where it's supposed to be. I think that's about as high as the patch actually goes. So, because this notch, I'm lined up with this notch here, over here. I'll show you. So, there's a, a notch here. That's the original notch. And then there's a notch on here. So I'm assuming you're supposed to be somewhere in that range, give or take a. Little tiny bit and we're right there on it. Or on the notch and this piece is supposed to go here. Hmm. So we just got to figure out a way to, we can, we can weld here, we can weld here, we can weld here. We need something that we can attach up under here and give us a little bit of a lip here. Let me know what you guys think. See you on the next one.